hey, I put a piece of foam under the strings. It's pretty neat. <laughs> this is really the first time I've ever experimented with that because I really like the, you know, sort of clang of um, round wound strings rattling against frets and all the sustain and the high end and all of that stuff. But this is pretty neat. So all I did was I took a piece of foam. I don't know where I got it. It's just like super squishy, soft foam. I had a little piece. Wedged it right under the strings. And... There's still some sustain. Uh, I did check the strings. They are ever so slightly sharp because that sort of makes sense. Um, but I could tune them for like recording or something. Um, this is just was just an experiment to see what it sounded like. I could definitely uh, tune with the foam under there and that would take care of any tuning issues um, although then there could be you know what then there would be um, intonation issues but Sorry, I'm not used to flat wound strings, uh, and I'm not used to uh, this bass. The frets are really low. Not used to that, and um, the short scale and everything. I'm just not used to it. That's why there was some some notes that came out a little wonky. And yes, I switched keys all of a sudden randomly. Sorry. It's kind of neat. I don't know how to play that song. sounds a little better on the bridge pickup. Um, check out my other video about this bass. The two pickups, there's something going on. So the little foam under there is pretty neat. I, I, I like it. 